Film and Sports Talk Worldwide with some news from the world of boxing. So y'all know what time it is. You ain't in a rush to get concussed. Now y'all, let's go up to these heavyweights and we ain't gonna talk to circus right now. We're gonna talk about something that's very, very shocking if you ask me. It really just hit me in the face like boom. Well, we know heavyweight contenders Dillian White, right? And Kubat Pulev, right? Are supposed to be in talks for a fight coming soon for that mandatory position in the IBF, right? So they had a purse bid on Thursday, and somebody who's not even promoting either one of the fighters wins the purse bid with $1.5 million. That's a shocker to me, because Dillian White's promoted by Eddie Hearn. Eddie Hearn uh, offered about $800 million, about $830 million. Right, Kyle Sauerland, who promotes Kubat Pulev, eight hundred million. Right, oh, eight hundred million, eight hundred thousand guys, eight hundred thousand. So they didn't even neither did uh, Eddie Hearn or Kyle Sauerland even bid a million for this. So Epic Sports and Entertainment, who doesn't promote either one of these guys? Somebody, a lawyer from um, Don King, runs this this uh, the format here. So they win, right? With one point five million. <laughs> So you're talking about Kubat Pulev is going to get 75% of this, going to get about 1 million, 1.1 million, and Dylan White going to get about 300,000, a little bit over 300,000 for this fight. That is shocking and it's significant when those kind of numbers come out because it lets the people know that are talking, when we're talking millions, 50 million, for example, with Anthony Joshua and Deontay Wilder, right? You're talking 12.5 million and things like that, 100 million generated with a fight, that might not last long. And here's an example of it. These guys are not that much worse than uh, Deontay Wilder or Anthony Joshua. This is right under that. Dillian White has lost one fight, and that's two Anthony Joshua when we know he was fighting with one arm. Right? Kubat Pulev lost to Vladimir Klitschko. Well, Vladimir Klitschko was Vladimir Klitschko. And that fight against Kubat Pulev, you could tell Kulev Pulev was undefeated. He didn't know how to lose. He was just doing that left hook. Just kept popping him <laughs> from Vladimir, right? So uh, that was a good Vladimir he lost, too. These guys haven't lost to anybody else, guys. They're right under that. And, and you know, a million is tops for, for Kubrat and uh, 300000 for your boy Dillian White. That is significant. That's another reason why that mega fight between our two undefeated champions has to happen. This is a big disparity, if you ask me. I think these guys here, you know, with one losses, fighting to become the mandatory should be worth more than that, actually. Or the other fight shouldn't be worth more, that much. So that's why I'm saying that stuff, that's the con those um those contract problems we having, and the sign a deal when you're talking about 100 million, better sign it while the getting is good. This is a great example of that. Now, questions are going to be asked, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> For example, for Dillian White, you know, the question definitely comes to mind is you're going to get 300, you know, thousand for uh, Kubat Pulev. What would you get for fighting Lewis the Real King Kong Ortiz? Because the Deontay Wilder fight is promised if you were to beat him. So Dillian White's going to probably have to make some decisions here. Does he take 300,000 and beat up Kubat Pulev? Which isn't a given, guys. Do not, don't know who Kubat Pulev is. He doesn't have any significant wins. But I'm going to tell you something, you're going to have to go beat him. First of all, you're going to have to get past that jab, which I think is one of the top three jabs in the division. So, you know, you ain't going to just walk over there and beat Kulev Pulev, but the thing is, will the fight happen? This one probably will because Kubat going to get a million. And, and his boy ain't getting but 300000 I would like to see how this is going forward. It's very interesting. But those numbers should resonate with people who are saying 50 million, like 50 million, and everybody get it. You understand? This is a perfect example of that. Everybody does it. And these are good heavyweights that are not even getting in the stratosphere. So recognize. Film Sports Talk, worldwide. And I'm about to hear y'all.